whether they're safe and sound in the loving arms of the Savior. All right, it's time to welcome the children. So tell you what, why don't you work your way? Usually we talk up here, don't we? So why don't you work your way up here? Uh, why don't you go, go around Mrs. Wickman here, around the organ there. And the ringers, if you want to be part of the children's sermon, you're welcome to do that. <laughs> We're all children of God. Come on up. We always have a, a brief conversation before they go off to Sunday school. Good morning. Uh, why, don't you, why don't we all stand around here? And um, I also wanted to welcome, by the way, a lot of people are joining us online today. There's a, there's a very large online audience today because of the weather conditions and so forth. So we extend a cordial welcome to everybody who's joining us online. Now, look what I have here today. Have you seen, have you seen anything like this lately? You did? Okay, what do you see here? You see a heart. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, it's a heart. Now, why do you think I brought a picture of a heart to church? Why do you think? Go for it. That's absolutely right. You're right on it. Tomorrow is Valentine's Day, St. Valentine's Day. And we always think about this little picture of the heart when we think about our Valentines. St. Valentine was a very special person who was a follower of Jesus. Yeah, you have a question already? Oh, okay, your airplane made it to church. Okay. <laughs> uh, very good, very good. Yeah, pretty treacherous day to fly, but I'm glad you got here safely. Are you the pilot? Are you, you flew the plane here? You, everybody got here safe? No. No? I didn't fly it. Oh, you didn't fly it? It's too small. Okay, well, I see you, got, you have wings on your jacket. I thought you just got off the plane. All right, well, God bless you. Hope you're safe. Where were we? Oh, yeah, Valentine's Day. <laughs> Valentine's Day is tomorrow, and you're going to see a lot of pictures of hearts, and people are going to exchange cards, and there's going to be uh, little chocolate containers shaped like a heart and all that kind of neat stuff, flowers and all. But you know what this is all about? Who gave us love? God gave us love, right? God made love. And the Bible says that God is love. God is pure love. And the Bible also said that God loves us so much that he gave us his son, Jesus. And if you turn around, look at that banner that our friends brought with, with them today. Do you, those of you who can read, can you see that? What does it say there? There you go. Yeah, you have to turn your head a little bit. Yeah, yeah. You could say God is love. You could say love is of God. Yeah, but they're also mentioning love. And so tomorrow, I want you to think about this. A very precious gift from God is the gift of love. So God loved the world. God loves you. God sent Jesus into the world because he loves us so much. And I have a homework assignment for you. I do. I have a homework assignment. Sometime today, I want you to go to someone you love and say, I love you to that person. Maybe it'll be your mother or your father or somebody else, a neighbor, a friend. Just say, I love you. And you know what? You're probably going to hear back. They're going to say, I love you too. They will. So I'm going to say, I love you. Jesus loves you. And God is love. That's our message today. God is love. Can we all pray about that? Let's all join in prayer together. Lord, we thank you for all the great gifts you give us, especially the gift of love. It is so precious and it's to be shared. As your son said, love one another as I have loved you. Thank you, Lord, for a special holiday where we can especially say that I love you. Thank you, Lord. We love you and thank you for your love. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Well, I hope you have a great day. Some of you are going to Sunday school. Uh, Mrs. Aaron, are you ready to go for Sunday school? And uh, grown-ups, if you're able to stand up, please rise as we offer our first hymn for today. 